Hello and welcome. Flyer. You might want to write in this form. Okay, so you read it as PNS 415W 16mm by 6 meters grade 60. But what does this stand for? So the PNS stands for Philippine National Standard, as you can see here. Next, these two here 415 and 60. This, these are the yield strength of the river or the F1 for structural engineers. Okay, so you need it as 415 MPA or 415 megapascal and 60 stands for 60 KSI or 60 kips per square inch. Okay. Next is the W or the weldability of the rebar. NW which stands for non-weldable or W which stands for weldable as you can see here. Next for the polar boats. In this picture, for a regular steel bar, you will see a yellow color at both ends of the bar. While for the two asterisks, you will see one color red and another color for a weldable steel bar. Okay. Next we'll take a look at 16 mm by 6 meters. So it is the diameter of the rebar and the length of the rebar 16 mm and 6 meters. So in this example you see that 16 millimeters is equal to 1.6 centimeters okay as you can see in the steel meter tape okay next for the commercial sizes that are available in the market we have 10 millimeters 12 mm 16 mm 20 25 28 32 36 40 50 and 58 so 40, 50, and 58, these are special orders. Take note for estimators or engineers, 25 to 58 mm diameter, mahirap ordering yan. Okay, so pag nagkulang ka sa quantity takeoff mo, hindi mo yan mapapabili sa mga tao mo, then hindi mo yan mabibili ka agad sa suking hardware. 
and pabibitbit mo sa mga labor mo. Okay? So, kailangan may pasobra ka sa yung estimate. Okay? Next is the commercial length, 6 meters. 7.5, 9, 10.5, 12, 13.5, and 15 meters. So, again, for 13.5 and 15 meters, these are special orders. Okay? Ibig sabihin ng special orders, so, pili lang yung mga supplier na kaya mag-fabricate ng 13.5 meters and 15 meters. Okay? Again, wala yan sa mga suking hardware. Next is the rebar grades. So, grade 33 or PNS 230. Usually use this for low-rise buildings and low-loading conditions. So, basically, what are low-loading conditions? These are the elements like masonry walls and or um, stirrups or ties for beams or columns. Okay. Then, next is the grade 40 or PNS 275 use this for medium rise structures for infrastructure work like uh, again stirrups for beams and ties for columns okay then for the high grade grade 60 and 415 use this for medium and high rise structures or infrastructures or major reinforcements for footing Beams, columns, okay. So that's it for this video. I hope you learned something. So don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell again. Yeah? Thank you for watching and see you again in the next video.